Okay, we are out today um, hanging out with big beautiful rhubarb plant. Um, and since we stopped the flowers from happening so it wouldn't seed out, um, we're getting lots of energy to the actual plant. But we are going to have supper with um, a really good friend tonight. So I want to make a strawberry rhubarb pie. So we are going to, for the first time, this is the second or third year this plant has been going. I hope you guys can see well. Um, we are going to harvest some of the big, bigger rhubarb stalks. So, excuse me. Um, so that all these new little ones can have room to grow. Um, I heard that when you pull one stalk, that when you harvest one stalk, you are um, helping to grow in its place. So I'm hoping that that's the case. This is just such a beautiful plant. But I also don't want it to go to waste. So I'm going to go down, and I think I'm going to start taking some of the ones. Um, there were some of the first ones out, some of these big stalks. But this one's kind of green. I'm not sure how that matters if the green ones are okay I figure it doesn't really matter because I'm gonna take these big ones anyways because yeah so here I go um, I saw that how you harvest um, is just by grasping a stalk and um, twisting and pulling but you don't want to ever um, cut your rhubarb because um, it's damaging to the plant so this is how you do it um, and that's what we do and so that's it that's our our first stalk um, remember never to eat the leaves the leaves are poisonous to humans so cut them off there okay I believe I need about three cups of rhubarb for pie. So, let's see, this one is big and red. So I think we'll go ahead and pull that one out. Oh, that one's pretty. Excuse my shadow. That one's pretty. Okay. Three cups. I can see all the new ones on there. Like this guy, don't mind the weeds. But like this guy, he needs to come out. He's sucking energy. I see all these new ones? And I guess they're just not gonna, they're not gonna do good if all these other ones are in their way. Um, this one. So that one came right up. in the wrong spot. So we try and get it lower. There we go. Sometimes they harvest themselves that way, I guess. Look, there's all kinds of little babies down there. We just don't have any room. Let's see. Oh. Harvesting rhubarb is actually pretty fun. I've never done it before. What? Um, I saw a bumblebee on a dandelion. Mm hmm. Remember what the bumblebees do? Yeah. What do they do? They make us honey. They, and they pollinate. I know. I just, uh, I'm, I'm just, I'm not afraid of the body. I'm just afraid of the stinger. Yeah. But you don't need to be afraid. As long as you're not messing with them. They won't mess with you. Alright, I think we have quite a few stocks now. I think well, that'll be good. Look, it opened up so much room over here. Now I feel like I should pull this big one too. So that they can have 
<clears throat> Man, look at that. This is such a great plant. We're not playing with those. So there, I've opened up a lot, thinned it out a lot. So now we'll get pie, and it'll give all these sweet babies room to grow. Spider! Push it! No, I don't want to shoot! Where is it? He's right there. That's okay. But now all these little babies will have room to grow, and you can see right here. There's a new one gonna come up. The new ones all back in there, so this was good. Good for the plant. Um, so that's our rhubarb harvest. There. I buy them? Lay them all out. Keep moving. Can you just push them with the rhubarb? Broken one. So that's our harvest. We're gonna go make some pie. Later, y'all.